it working? I think it's working. So, hi guys, welcome back. Today I'm just going to be doing like a get ready with me with like my current super basic go to makeup look routine thing. Um, as you can see, you are pointed in a mirror. This is the best way I could come up with to film this. It's also kind of artsy. I'm gonna watch this back and post and either love it or hate it. I have slated a, another makeup video for next week. We will find out then <laughs> whether I hated this setup or not. Stay tuned. With that being said, let's get into the video, shall we? Um, okay, so. I already have chapstick on, so that's done. Um, normally I would use this Burt's Bees shy, but um, I just have random chapstick, or random chapstick number four on today, and it's fine. It all does the same stuff pretty much. Um, normally I would, um, like if I'm just going to wear this all day. I would put this primer on, which is by Maybelline. It's the Master Prime Face Studio Primer Base in 400. But I'm maybe going to have this on for two hours, so I kind of don't care. <laughs> yeah. So, that all being said, that I already have. Chapstick on, not priming. I'm gonna start with my eyebrows. I'm just gonna use this a bomb eyebrow pencil in Auburn and just kinda go in and fill them in. And if you're wondering why I keep reaching and looking for things over there, I have my caboodle all set up. And then also in the lower drawer over here, I have um, bigger stuff like my brush set and some palettes. So yeah, everyone's day going. And I kind of, I don't know, sometimes I just kind of wrap it in with my finger to kind of blend in. No. Just because. I kind of, I like a blender brow, honestly. Um, once I use out that, the brow stuff I currently have in the Auburn shade, um, I'm probably going to find like a medium to dark brown color pencil thing. Um, because I just kinda like a darker bolder brow on myself. Um, Yeah, but I, I went through a phase where all of my brow stuff was like Auburn because I got my hair red and it looked the best. Auburn fit me best at that point, but now this purple, you know, it's, it works, but not the way I want. Now I'm just going to go with my foundation, which is the Milani Screen Queen Natural Finish Foundation in shade 140. Just going to take this random brush that I have, just kind of work it on there, and just kind of up. But lately, my go-to, um, I mean, has been this, but I haven't 
been using concealer on the daily just because it can get really clumpy really fast. <sighs> At least when I do it. Um, by clumpy, I just mean like just a lot of layers of stuff on my face and I'm just not and I just worry about transferring and I just up in my thing lately. Especially just for like Zoom calls. <laughs> and that would be my neighbor's dogs. foundation matches a lot better without concealer too. Is the world ending? I mean, yeah, but like, outside my window. going to go in with my Maybelline New York Shine Free Loose Powder in shade Light 01 and just take this flat powder brush and just kind of smush it in my face. Smush, smush, smush. And in particular I do this in kind of areas where I was like a little bit more covered. Now I'm just going to take this Huda Light Bronzer from it's the Huda Light Bronzer from Benefit and just kind of, kind of contour. I'm going to take, I think this, this is an Avon blush brush, but I use it more so for contour. I'm just going to take a little bit of it and just kind of add a little bit of color, a little bit of something. My face. Now I'm taking the Benefit Rock Couture Blush and just putting it on my face with this blush brush. It's hard to say blush, brush, blush, blush. Some days I would put eyeliner on with this, but today I'm going super basic because pretty much wearing this just the film and intro slash outro for the video you all saw last week. So I'm just going to put on mascara and lip color. <laughs> and so this is the Maybelline New York Rocket Volume Express Mascara. I'm just going to... Brush it down. You know. Brush it down. 
Oh my god, let's see if my brush up. And I mean, some days too, I would do my lowers, but I'm just not, not really feeling it today. Um, yeah. And I think today I'm gonna use this random Ulta Beauty matte lip crayon in shade Soiree that I got like five years ago. But I'm trying to use up things, so we're gonna use it. I ever think like my lip color is the number one thing I change up most frequently and my makeup routine. Um definitely go through faces. Or I like more reds. And then there's time where I like more purples and more browns and So this is my current basic go-to makeup look, and I will probably change my mind on it about in about three days, because that's how things work. You say this is my go-to, and then three days later you change your mind, and the entire routine is different. And that's okay. Um, if you like this video, please let me know by commenting, liking, and subscribing if you feel so inclined. Other places you can follow me on the internet will be linked down below in the description box. And I hope to see you next time. Bye!